Okay. I'm at the government secondary school in Raquel. I am Aisha Tabangua. I am the guidance counselor of the government school here in the secondary school. I am Susan Piaz, acting vice principal, government of the secondary school. I am Lydia Shaw, the link teacher, linking government of care secondary school in Bakersfield in the UK. And here are some books sent through Build on Books um, to this school from the Beaconsfield School. Uh, would any of you like to, t to send a message to the Beaconsfield School? Yes, I would like to thank them for their support, for the books that they have sent us. We appreciate them very much and may God bless them. And we pray that they will continue to assist us with more books. You got a message? I am so delighted to be here this afternoon to talk about books. We have been talking about books since you came. We hope they'll be able to send us some more books so that more children will be more interested in whatever we are doing. Okay. Thank you. Hi, Halisin. I am Lydia, and I thank you for, for um, and I miss you a lot <laughs> since the last time I saw you. Say hi to the other teachers, to those in the, um, the technology lab, just dealing with the computer, computing. I've learned so much from you that I can use the complete computer effectively now. Say hi to Louise Gertrude when she, she returned from her leave. Okay. And thank you for the books that you sent. That, that I think will improve the, 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 the talking skill of my children at the government workers in the school. Thanks a lot. So we talked about a new program rather than just having the books in the library for the children to read and also they're being used by the teachers but we talked about starting a new program of actually letting the books, children take the books home. Um, what, what do you think of um, this idea of letting the children take the books home to read with yeah, their families? It will help them to improve more. It will improve on their reading skills and they'll find reading more enjoyable when they take their home and read because they'll be reading in a relaxed atmosphere instead of sitting in a cramped up room trying to read a book. Okay. And I think we, we agreed that um, we don't expect uh, the children to lose the books. We expect them to return them. But, but if you do find that some of the books are going astray, then uh, through Build on Books and through the Beaconsfield School, we'll try to send you more books to replace those. And in addition, we'll be trying to send more books that you need in any case. Um, so do you, do you agree with that? That's yes. a good idea. I do agree. Um, is there any more messages for the Beaconsfield School about what you would like the relationship to be in the future? I'd like us to sustain that relationship in the future so that the kids will have more time to do so. If you have time to go and visit them, that's great. And do you have any messages about the partnership um, yes. with your school in Beaconsfield? Yes, we want the relationship to continue to be maintained. Just as we show ourselves, that they come and visit us and see the way we live, and also for our children to go exchange visits with us. And in a situation where they cannot go immediately, I think correspondence will be a good job. If they have their pen pals with whom they can be exchanging letters, they'll get to learn more about our culture and we will learn more about their own culture. These yes. exchange programs are really good for a country like Sierra Leone. People will get to know about our country. One thing, suggestion that I made is that the Beaconsfield School will help you set up a Facebook page as some children and teachers do now have Facebook on their phones. And if the schools could communicate through Facebook, that would be very useful as well because you could show each other photographs. Um, that's a, you know, a little bit more for the future, but I think it's something we could work toward. Um, Lydia, you've actually been using technology yourself and using the... Years ago, we used to send cards to the children. Not so the show. We used to send cards to them, Christmas cards. How was that? How were you managing that program for, in terms it of was through, plan, through plans? Yes. Right. We used to exchange 
But it's wound up. So I think what we were suggesting, I'll let you get your phone, um, was that possibly a relationship through the British Council might be more useful. Um, yes, I, I probably should have thought about this beforehand and got you to, the children to write some letters. But I am here till next week. Uh, so I could take letters back. But when, when are you leaving? Monday. Uh, no, but just no, to... Right. This is just a short visit. We want to hear from you soon. As, okay. And we hope you send us dictionaries. Oh, dictionaries, yes. Well, you know, I think that um, in the UK, a lot of children aren't using the dictionaries anymore because they have dictionaries on the computer and their phone. So we'll perhaps ask Alison if the children can go around their home and collect up all their dictionaries and put them in a box and ship them. How many dictionaries do you need? How many? As many as you can. We can always appreciate because beggars have no choice. <laughs> you're not beggars, you're partners. Yeah, they're partners. And don't forget, our schools in the UK, <laughs> such as the Beckersfield School, they get a lot out of this relationship as well. And so I would say you're partners. And um, so, how many dictionaries are we talking about? Several hundred? Yeah, we have over a thousand people here. So if you can provide one for each people, it will be more satisfied about 1, 000, as the 500. 500. So, whatever number you give us will be appreciated. Yeah. Because they will always be made available to them when they need them. Yes. Yes. So um, we'll, we'll try and work on that. And uh, I thank you very much. I've had a wonderful time at, at this school. I'm so glad to see that uh, not all the books are in the library because I understand they were, they were taken into storage during the holidays. Um, but I'm so glad to see that the books are here and they're being used. The children are enjoying them. Uh, I certainly will be looking forward to see the results of the project where the children take the books home. Thank you. So, thank you. Thank you very much. Sorry? Thank you. We appreciate you very much. Okay. Thank you. Wait, goodbye. Thank you. Okay. Hope to see you again. Red forms are available.